Shall I pour, Mr. Butler? Uh, no, thank you, Aldo. Will there be anything else, sir? Mm, yes. Tell Mrs. Butler to join me. Very well, sir. Should I keep a plate warm for Miss Butler? Mm, yes. I've been worried about her. We've seen so little of Vicky since she came home for the holidays. But she's always been so unpredictable. All right, sir. I'll go get Mrs. Butler for you. There you are, Angela. Raymond. <laughs> Coffee, darling. Yes, thanks. I must talk to Audley. Look at this coffee cup. It's a scandal. Tarnish and fingerprints all over it. Raymond. You haven't heard a word I said. Oh, I'm sorry, darling. I guess I'm just worried about Vicky. Vicky, 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 all I ever hear is Vicky. Vicky. Daddy. <laughs> Your cheeks are as cold as ice. What you need is a nice warm glass of milk. Angela. You rang, sir. Oh, good evening, Miss Butler. Evening, Aldo. <gasps> I had to. He was standing under the mistletoe. That will be all, Aldo. Who could that be at this hour? Are you expecting anyone? Not that I know of. Vicky, what was the meaning of that little display? It was an impulse. <coughs> Don't you ever have impulses? You trap! It fired your mother eyes! This just arrived by messenger. It's for you, madam. Two, three. 